leaves fall and the temperatures drop, a lot of us start thinking about making soup. Absolutely. Of we had soup last night at the DeRussia house, Excellent. and I spent a little time in the Cambria kitchen with Le Cordon Bleu chef instructor Ashley Mandel, who shows us how to make a perfect butternut squash soup with a little bit of a twist. It's the fall, and Chef Ashley from Le Cordon Bleu, you got to do soups, right? Yep. So this one's like a vegetable um, kale. Um, we got parsnips in there um, and some squash. And then this one is our beef bourguignon. Whoa. So our Julia oh. Child. Classic. Our, a classic. She's soup. a grad of ours. Yeah. And then we have our butternut squash soup, and we just have um, we just took some prosciutto. And uh, we just caramelized it up a bit. Okay, that's what we're gonna do now. And yep. chef, you've done this exactly how I like to do soup. Have it all ready to yep. go so you can just rock it. Yep. So we're just what we did is we chopped up celery, onions, um, threw a bunch of garlic in there. And that's first. Yep. And that's first. So we have, we already have our olive oil. As you can yeah. see, our olive oil and our butter. Good. That's going. Okay. There Perfect. we go. Thank you. Yeah. Very professional. What's next? And then we just threw and we just. Some potatoes right nice, in just there a as plain well. Plain old potatoes, yeah. and here we go. So we just have some Yukon Gold. So we just cubed up, and then we have our butternut squash the puree. The star of the show. This is the star. So we have the chicken stock here, and then we have the heavy cream. And you don't want to use anything other than heavy cream. You don't want to use half and half. Um, it's healthier, so there's not as much flavor. Okay, so you want heavy cream. You want heavy, heavy cream. We'll pour in our chicken stock, and you're just going to want to let this cook down. And let that just kind of simmer. And you can let that go for about 20 minutes. Nice whisk. Yeah. How often do you stir it while you're cooking it? Um, you can just. A little bit. Get, just keep yeah, it just keep it moving. That's okay. all the soup is. It's so, so easy. Very, very easy. But it's such a essential classic for fall. Let's talk about butternut squash. It's everywhere this time. Yep. Either. So you've got it as decorations, um, and then you can you can go ahead and eat it. So just you just want to have chop off the um, top and the bottom. Yep. And then just have it and throw a generous amount of salt and pepper on there. You just want to season it really well. Olive just oil. Roast her up. Roast 400 until you can start to smell it a little bit. So it's fork tender. Chef, I'm a little concerned. I think the police have come to haul you away. Well, I'm married to one, so you're gonna. Are you ready? <laughs> <laughs> you guys love butternut squash soup, yep. don't we love you? all kinds of squash. We'll take it in any kind of soup. Yep. <laughs> it looks great. Thanks so much, Chef. Thank you. And thank you, officer. You're welcome, thank you. Thanks for not arresting me. <laughs> We're just shooting the story and then Mike Kirchin comes in, he's like, hey. <laughs> and he wants some soup. So this is the great thing about the couch. Oh. You can just kind of walk into any building as a <laughs> right. TV. Right. Right. Welcome. So that officer is the officer behind Minneapolis Bike Cops for Kids, yeah. which oh, if cool. you're not following that on Facebook, you should. It's wonderful. Like the cops go out into the community and, you know, bring bike helmets yeah. to oh, kids. Wow. It's a really so cool the program. first interaction that a lot of young people have with police, it'll be with, with Mike, which mm. is pretty good. And he let you off the hook this he time. He did, so he's yeah. Cool. Thank goodness. <laughs> we started that story showing you a couple of other soups, a minestrone. Mm -hmm. And Julia Child's beef bourguignon, bourguignon. I can't even say oh, it. Really. No. <laughs> Don't even worry about it. But it's delicious. Just watch the movie Julia and Julia, and then they and keep saying they it. They say Meryl it. Yeah, yeah. Do it. Go to wccocom links We have recipes for all three of those soups.